Hiya, my name's Paul Dodd and I'm the current chairman of Radio Hasler. Um, I say the current chairman, there's only been three of us, um, Chris Pierce, Keith Fossey and now myself. I'm the shortest in time um, chairman, I mean, this is my third year, um, I've got two more to catch up on Keith. Um, the station's been on air since ooh, 10th of March 1993. We started um, way back then. In fact, it was started by a young lad called Chris Pierce. Him and a couple of his friends got together in a McDonald's. They were doing um, hospital radio over at the QA hospital in Portsmouth and decided that actually there was a need for it in, in Gosport with us having the biggest military hospital um, in Britain. When Hasler shut down at the beginning of this century, we had to move um, and having had a look at a few places, we found that Thorngate Halls provided uh, adequate, well I'd say adequate, yeah I'd like to say adequate premises, but actually they've been superb. Um, they've bent over backwards to help us, they've given us far more room than we th ever thought we would get. We've now got two studios, we've got this beautiful green room, um, and I'll tell you where we came about this in a minute. Um, and basically we took over the premises from Gosport Voluntary Action when they moved down to Martin Snape House. Not long before Asla shut down, about four or five years, we'd started um, broadcasting to the War Memorial uh, Hospital, which if people don't know is, it's, it, it's not only for, for patients recovering, but it has a speciality for brain injuries um, or head injuries. And of course, brain injuries encounter strokes, uh, all sorts of mental illness as well. Um, and there's a, there's a great need there because the, unlike, well now actually it's similar to Hazard.